from Yahoo Sports. Headline, Mets Minor League Roundup. Young talent continues to shine at all levels of the farm system. Now, I would mention that please subscribe to this channel if you want to hear more stuff on Mets minor leaguers and their prospects. Here's the latest on some of the Mets' top prospects. Okay, end fielder Ronnie Mauricio. He's at AAA Syracuse. Mauricio continues making an extremely strong case to get the call for his MLB debut. He was on base two more times on Friday night's win, including a clutch RBI double in the bottom of the ninth. The 22-year-old also drew a walk for the eighth time this month and added another stolen base to his ledger. After a bit of a rough stretch, Mauricio has gotten back into his groove. He's reached base in all but two games this month and is currently riding a seven-game hitting streak. He's now hitting 286 with an 868 OPS, three doubles, a triple, five home runs, and six stolen bases in August. Mauricio has shown it's well past time for him to get his shot in the big league level. He's now hitting 291 with an 842 OPS, three doubles, three triples, excuse me, 21 home runs, 29 doubles, <clears throat> 29, 23 stone bases, and 68 RBIs in the season. Third baseman Brett Beatty at AAA Syracuse. Since his demotion from the big leagues in early August, he has used the time in Syracuse to do nothing but continue to hit. He's reached base in all but three games dating back to August 10th, and he's driven in 14 runs over that span. Beatty finished 1 for 5 on Friday night, but his lone hit was a big one late in the game. After Mauricio doubled in a run, the sweet swinging lefty singled him home, even things up, and send the game to extras. Prior to his promotion, Beatty was lighting up in the International League, and the rookie hasn't missed a step since his return to the minors. It's encouraging to see the 23 year old look like his old self after struggling mightily in the majors especially right before being sent down. With Danny Mendig and John, Jonathan Arayus not providing much to the big league club, you might you have to figure it's only a matter of time before Beatty makes his return, but only time will tell. Outfielder Carlos Cortez, AAA Syracuse. Cortez is one of the lesser known prospects who deserves a shot to show what he can do in the big leagues. The 26-year-old is eligible for the Rule 5 draft at the end of the season, so why not see what you have in him while playing for nothing down the stretch? Cortez has always been a relatively streaky hitter throughout his minor league career, and right now he's riding a hot streak. He's coming off a three-hit performance on Friday night and is hitting 328 with an 11.05 OPS over his last 18 games. Cortez also has three doubles, six home runs, and 12 RBIs over that span. He's a bit of a utility man in the field, having spent time at both corner infield spots, second base, and left field during his career. Cortez is someone who could and certainly should receive a September call-up. Outfielder Drew Gilbert from Double A Binghamton. Since being acquired from the Ashes in the Justin Verlander trade, Gilbert has been showcasing why he's one of the top prospects in baseball. Through 19 games with Rumble Ponies, he's hitting 343 with a 988 OPS. Three doubles, a triple, four home runs, and 15 RBIs. The 22-year-old has drawn seven walks over that span which has helped his stellar 402 on base percentage. Gilbert has been an absolute force out of the second spot in the order for Binghamton. He's reached base in all but four games since joining the team and is currently riding a four game hitting streak, including a long ball on Friday night. Outfielder Ryan Clifford, high A Brooklyn. Brooklyn is currently in the midst of a two week road trip to Asheville, bringing Clifford back to where he began his career, his season. The return has brought some success for the slugger as he's homing in back-to-back -back games to push his hitting streak to four games. The 20-year-old now has 22 long balls on the season to go along with 72 RBIs and an 876 on base percentage. I mean OPS, excuse me. Clifford has struggled thus far as a cyclone hitting just 189 with 35 strikeouts through 19 games. He does have, have three doubles and four home runs over that span. Perhaps this little hot streak back in Asheville will get him going. Shortstop outfielder Jet Williams, High A Brooklyn. Since being promoted from low, a, from low A, Williams has continued his scorching hot stretch with the Cyclones. The 19 year old is currently running at a 12 game hitting streak. He's hitting 350 with a 480 on base percentage, an 1118 OPS, 8 doubles, 5 home runs, 14 RBIs, and 9 stolen bases through 22 games in Brooklyn. With another long ball on Friday, he now has four homers and 10 RBIs over his last six games. 
Looking even further, this visa has posted a scorching 350 average with 12 doubles, 7 homers, and 15 stone bases over his last 35 games. Williams has shown exactly why he's one of the top prospects in the organization. Now, of course, please subscribe to the Prospect Hut if you want more videos on the Met prospects, the Met minor leagues, and everything that entails. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.